Hello, I'm Gayatri Devan. Welcome to my life page. Today we'll be talking about entrepreneurship. Before that, I'd like to speak a little about myself. I did my education in Dehradun in Wellam Girls, after which I went on to Polytechnic to pursue arts. I did commercial arts from there. And then I went on to do other courses in makeup, hairstyling, salon management, and so on and so forth. Since I was always fond of doing creative things in life and I was very interested in fashion and makeup, I decided to launch my own brand. I launched a brand under the name of Mantra by Gayatri, which was my own salon. I started that in the year 2006. I worked very hard at it. It uh, did really well. I earned a good name in that. And in the last two months, I launched myself uh, with a bigger brand and signed up a franchise with Affinity Express, which is a very large brand in hair and makeup. Entrepreneurship is running the right kind of business, being totally hands-on on it, looking at every field, every difficulty, being there facing all the challenges with a smile and being a big support to your staff, to your team, to your workplace and working very hard with full dedication and creating your own brand value. First and foremost, it's human resources. Human resources includes the right kind of hiring, the know-how of how to motivate your staff, what kind of incentives to give them, how to rightly motivate them, how to do client consultation, and also what kind of salaries they deserve according to their right skills, according to their professional qualification. Very important to know your client, firstly. First, have an interaction with your client, understand the client's mind, understand what he or she wants, and then be able to convince the client in a right way as to go on with the next treatment or the next service, not only just what that person has come in for. That itself is a skill. It's a very important skill that we must all be aware of. Especially in my business, it gives me great satisfaction in the creativity we do. To see our clients happy and to see them go out of the salon with a smiling face gives me great satisfaction, happiness and achievement of well-being and self-worth. Of course, it's a challenge because the minute you walk into the salon as a leader or as an entrepreneur, there are two types of people who are out there waiting to grab you. One are some clients who are really fussy and have a lot of complaints, you have to learn how to deal with them. You have to know how to make them happy with a smile on your face. Even though they're not happy and they're abusing you maybe or being rude to you, you still have to talk to them with a smile and be able to convince them. The other type is your staff who are not easy to deal with. They are always complaining about salaries or incentives or maybe leave and things not going right as far as they are concerned. So you have to know how to deal with the staff as well and be able to make them happy and satisfy them. Walk in with a lot of expectations, hoping we have a good sale that day, hoping all my staff is there, trying to see everything is in order, all machines are working, um, you know, every product is there so that we are not short of anything. And it usually doesn't happen so there are always shortfalls there are always complaints it's very difficult to manage all this with a smile and yet do your work because it's a long day we do a lot of services we are standing most of the time there is no lunch hour we have no breaks we could be eating our lunch at maybe five o'clock so the days are very tough but yes it motivates you when you see happy customers you see people going out happy and at the end of the day, you come home feeling very, very satisfied as a professional. I hope I've been able to give you a balanced view on entrepreneurship. Thank you.